Hey guys, welcome to SA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to get into BIOS when boot is too fast or BIOS not opening after pressing the BIOS key. If you are having trouble getting into BIOS because the boot is too fast, then here are some basic and advanced tips that can surely help to fix the problem. So let's get started. Restart your computer and keep pressing the BIOS key as first as possible. The BIOS key is usually displayed on the screen during the boot process and it is often F2, F10, F12 or delete key. In my case, the BIOS key is F2. But unfortunately, as you can see, BIOS key is not working in my case. Here's a list of common BIOS keys by manufacturer. Keep pressing the key repeatedly as soon as the computer restarts until you enter in the PC's BIOS. If you are lucky, then this simple method may help to solve your problem. Use a different keyboard. Try using a different keyboard because as some keyboard may have the slow response time and may not register your key presses in the time to access the BIOS. After that, hopefully your problem will be solved. Disable Fast Startup Fast Startup is a feature in Windows that speeds up the boot process by hibernating the system instead of shutting it down completely. This can prevent you from entering BIOS. To disable Fast Startup, go to Control Panel. Select Power option. Choose what the power button do. Change settings that are currently unavailable. Uncheck Turn on first startup, which is the recommended option. Click on OK to saving changes. After that, restart your computer and keep pressing the BIOS key to check if the problem is solved or not. Boot into BIOS from Windows. Some computer manufacturers allow you to enter BIOS from within Windows. To do this, press the Windows key plus I to open the settings. Select Update and Security. Click on Recovery under System. Click on Restart Now under Advanced Startup. Select Troubleshoot, then Advanced option. After that, UEFI Framework Settings and click on Restart to entering in the PC's BIOS. That's it. Clear CMOS. Clearing the CMOS can reset the BIOS settings to their default values, which can help if the BIOS is not opening. To do this, shut down your computer and unplug it from the power source. Open the computer case and locate the CMOS coin cell battery on the motherboard. Remove the battery and wait for a few minutes before putting it back in. And some computer manufacturers motherboards has also a CMOS clearing button. And also you may need to press CMOS clearing button after remove the CMOS coin cell battery.
Note: Some motherboards are made in such a way that it's necessary to remove the CMOS coin cell battery for a long time to reset the BIOS. So, basically when the power supply to the CMOS chip is disconnected and it will automatically reset all the settings to default. After 10 to 30 minutes, reconnect the CMOS coin cell battery. and gently reassemble and reattach the AC power cable. After that, turn on the system and be ready to enter your PC's BIOS by pressing the BIOS key to check if everything went well. That's it. If none of these steps works for you, then you may need to update your PC's BIOS. If the problem persists, you may need to update your BIOS. You can do this by visiting your computer manufacturer website and downloading the latest BIOS version for your motherboard. But note, you probably should not update your BIOS if your system is working properly. Because in some cases, a PC user may encounter new bugs with a new version of BIOS. So, it is necessary that update your BIOS when your system needs to be add some new features, security patches, performance improvements, and when a new version of BIOS may fix a bug with an obscure piece of hardware or add support for a new model of CPU. So, it is better to consult or contact manufacturer for further assistance. So, I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share, we need your support and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you, thanks for watching, have a nice day.